right, man. So Jamison Williams uh, look like he will play. Look like he will play uh, Sunday versus the Titans. Now, apparently, most people are speculating, like Adam Scheffner, that he is appealing his suspension. Right? That the Lions are appealing his suspension. Now, that means he'll be able to play versus Tennessee. But if he gets suspended and the ruling comes down swiftly, he's going to be suspended not only for the Green Bay, which he was suspended for originally, he's going to be suspended for what the Sunday or Monday night game versus the Houston Texans. You know what I'm saying? So that's what you got to understand. Like, if he just take the suspension, if, if it is an appeal, and he take the suspension, he going to miss the Tennessee game. Most people feel like they could beat Tennessee the Titans, no disrespect to them. They just traded DeAndre Hopkins. And then he will miss the Green Bay game, and then he'll be back for the Houston game. Now, you know, if he turn around and, you know, he wins the suspension, he's like a genius. So we really still don't know what the suspension is. We know it's either a stimulant, a masking agent, or a diuretic. That's what we know. Unless he can prove that he took something and it contains that and he can prove it, it was contaminated or it was, you know, whatever, then yeah. But the way kind of Dan Campbell beating around the bush is like he made a mistake. That's kind of what I'm, I'm kind of looking at. Like they admitting that he made a mistake. So maybe they got lawyers to find a loophole, but then you eat that Tennessee loss and maybe try to even get Harold Landry and chop it up with their GM and try to get Harold Landry from the Titans. But I feel like the Titans is a quarterback away from being the contenders in the AF. Well, still, even with trading DeAndre, I feel like they're a quarterback away from being contenders in the NFL and the AFC. They have, and I said that in a prediction video, they have a really good roster. You know, Jeffrey Simmons is, is one of the best in his position. Uh, 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 Legere Sneed is maybe the best at his position, one of the best at his position. So, you know, they quarterback away, so I don't know how much they want to give up. But, like I continue to tell y'all, you know, um, like I continue to tell y'all, man, like, they got to play this smart. Take the suspension, take the Tennessee loss, take the Green or the Tennessee game and roll the dice to Green Bay. You will see Green Bay again. But if I'm them, I just say, well, we go ahead and take that suspension right now. You know, but if they win it, they look like, but we don't know enough about what's going on. You know, she was on trade J-Mo for, to the Raiders for Max Crosby in the first round pick. The problem with that is this. They ain't got no quarterback, so J-Mo ain't going to help. And also, they love the kid, and the people in the city of Detroit love the kid. So, he making some mistakes. I mean, so be it. Hopefully he, you know, hopefully he learned from his mistakes. But I ain't trade him. Unless it's a, a super duper dope deal. But nah. He, like I said the other day in a couple of my, my live I did in my video, he brings a unique blend of track speed and football player. He's a, a football player with track speed. He ain't just a track star, just a football player, but he got both. You know how rare that is? You know, Tyreek Hill was more of a, a track guy. You know, he was more of a track guy. You know, and he molded himself into a football player. J-Mo's a football player that just so happened to be a track guy. So, that's the difference. That's the difference. That's the true difference. But, you know, I, I understand it. So, but, we don't have enough. So, they haven't laid a suspension out yet. So, if they're appealing it, is it an investigation? Did some uh, proof of, uh, did some proof of, come on, come on. 
out. Don't just pull your ass out there. Is it proof of maybe contamination or a mistake? We don't know. But if he appealed, he, they miss Green Bay and Houston, he's going to be eating. A lot of Detroiters going down to Houston, too, for that game. A lot of them. I know a bunch of people going to that game. Detroit Lions Talk playlist for more videos like this. Let me know what you think in the comment section. Appreciate it.